Hello everybody, welcome back to another fossil hunting video. Today I've come to Robiners Bay in the search for some rare fossils, hopefully the odd ammonite or so, if I'm lucky. So usually when I come to Robiners Bay I'm searching around this area, but for a change today I'm heading towards that way. It's quite sparse and you can probably see the tide is pretty much all the way into the cliffs, but I am going to head that way and hopefully it'll be on its way out soon. So not really much as expected at the first bit. The tide is still really far in at this little part here. So I am gonna have to wait probably an hour or so for it to go out. I'm gonna have a look around the pebbles and see if I can spot anything else. Cause I've done near the cliffs, but I'm just gonna do near the sea. And I'll get back to her if there's anything interesting. Just pick this pyritic cannonball nodule up. Let's see if there's anything inside. nothing inside but it was heavily piratized by the look of that oh well at least it split easily finally around the uh, nab over there now it's quite sandy but we're gonna have a look and see if we can spot anything good I'm hoping that as the tide goes out it will reveal a few rock pools to search through I'm supposed to be looking for rarities today, but I've just found this bloody dak. Typical. I've just spotted this in this big shale block. A nice bivalve shell that I'm going to extract. Hopefully it's loose enough. Yep. Very nice. So I've just cracked this shelly block open here. Let's see if there's any ammonites inside. I've not found much today, so it would be nice if there was. Let's get the top off. Oh, wow, well, look at that. An, um, uh, an Amalfius. Really cool, that's the uh, best find of the day. Look at that. Check out that one for a big old juicy duck. The keel is sticking out right there. And you can see part of it there, so it goes all the way around and the end is there. Brilliant, I'm gonna take that one back. So we've got something else quite unusual. I don't recognize the material or the shape of the ammonite, but it's a tiny little one inside this cracked rock, which I've just hit open with my hammer. You can see the keel on the edge there. Could be quite a rare one hit quite a productive spot here if you'd like to purchase your very own fossil from the Yorkshire coast please check out my website called buyafossil.com I've got a lot of really nice prepared ammonites up for sale some fossil bone and also some dactyloceros ammonites where you can crack them open at your own house I'll ship your orders worldwide thanks shame that that's not all there you can see the whirl of any ammonite poking out right there a huge whirl from a very big ammonite. You can see the suture marks. I'll zoom in. That's the uh, lines where the ammonite was growing. That would have been a really big one. I'm gonna take that one back because it's something different. Just starting to make my way back. I definitely call today a success as I initially set out only to find rarities and I'm very happy with this Amalfius. I'll get it prepared and it'll be a really nice one for my display. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video and I will see you all on the next one.